Hello, it's Greg Harrelson again, here to answer another question uh, that we get quite often for uh, people that are thinking about selling a property in our area. Um, you know, every, everyone knows that Myrtle Beach, South Carolina and the Grand Strand, we're, we're definitely a resort town. We have a beach, we have oceanfront condos, we have water parks, so a lot of people come down here in the summer to spend their vacations. So, you know, the, uh, I, I think most people think, gosh, the best time to sell a property is actually in the summer. So, let me answer the question, when is the best time to sell? It really depends on the type of property that you have. Um, you know, if you have a oceanfront condo, then obviously you want to you want to present that property on the MLS when the most people are here that are looking for oceanfront condos. If you have a golf course condo, you may actually think about selling your property in the fall, in the spring. That's golf season. That's the time that the golfers are down here. If you have a second home or a retirement home, then you got to think about who are the buyers for second homes and retirement homes. Well, the reality is is those buyers are typically retirees or people that uh, you know are a little bit more mature and they're gonna spend six or seven months down here well what months do they usually spend a lot of times they're getting rid of the uh, getting away from the harsh winters up north and they're coming down here in the winter so the good thing about our market is there's always sales taking place if you look at every season you'll see that the sales are very consistent when it comes to the number of sales in every season. But the buyer changes. In the summer, the buyers that are down here are typically younger families. They're either relocating to our market and they're gonna relocate in the summer because they don't want their kids to, they wanna make sure that their kid starts off in their new school right after the summer. You'll see that uh, in the uh, fall and in the spring, we're selling to a little bit more mature buyer. A lot of times they're golfers, they're retired, they have a little bit more money, but they're coming down here. There might be fewer of them, but they're qualified and they actually purchase second homes. And then in the winter, you're gonna see again, a lot of retirees who are avoiding harsh winters. Um, or the people who are buying in the winter a lot of times are those up north that are trying to get away from the snow and the ice that they're experiencing so they're coming down in the winter season the the, the thing that i want you to understand most is that when you should sell has is, is a personal decision it really has more to do with what you're looking to accomplish but i want you to have the confidence that our market is not necessarily seasonal it's who we're selling the properties to that changes during each season. Hopefully that will help. If you have any questions, this is Greg Harrelson with Century 21. I'd love to help you.